Scanning in Macintosh is a little bit different from scanning in Windows. Start by selecting the Scan button from inside SmartScore. If you get an error message such as this, it means SmartScore cannot locate the Twain driver for your scanner. Twain drivers allow third-party programs such as SmartScore to control your scanner. They are now completely embedded in Apple's operating system, so we'll need to back out and use another approach. Note that we're talking about scanning from inside SmartScore and not from the software that came with your scanner, which should always work normally since it's not Twain. We'll now go to File, Scan Music, Select Interface, and choose Your Scanners. Hopefully this will launch your scanner's control software. If it does not, you can always launch it from the Applications folder or from the dock as we're doing here. We are now entirely within your scanner's software, not in SmartScore. You may need to make some settings that SmartScore does automatically, such as scanning resolution, bit depth, and saving to the correct file type. This is an HP scanning interface. It creates a grayscale image when documents with text is selected. Other models may require you to select text or documents or grayscale, but they all do the same thing. You will want to scan at 3 to 400 dots per inch resolution if that control is available. This HP interface automatically scans at 300 dpi when docs, documents with text is selected. Once the first page is scanned, you should be able to uh, select Next Page or Scan Next Item. Once you finish scanning all of your pages of music, you will want to save the file as PDF. No two scanning applications are alike, so you may have to hunt around to find the right options. It's an imperfect world after all. Go ahead and close out of your scanner software and go back to SmartScore. Select the Begin Recognition button and then push Add Files to List. Browse to the location where you saved your scan file and select it. The PDF file will automatically be, be converted to TIFF and all the pages will then be opened in SmartScore's image editor. If you don't need to clean up pages, go ahead and save and select Begin Recognition. As a rule, you can just select uh, the defaults, just accept them. Uh, they're handy, especially for managing more complex scores. A little bit of cleanup in SmartScore's uh, notation editor. and you're good to go.